Have you ever pondered the immense power that lies within the depths of your subconscious mind? An invisible force, the subconscious mind, operates behind the scenes, subtly shaping our behaviors, actions, and ultimately, our lives. It's like the silent puppeteer pulling the strings, guiding us in ways we often don't even realize. The subconscious mind is a vast, untapped reservoir of potential, brimming with beliefs, ideas, and experiences. It's like a vast library, storing every single event, every emotion, every thought that we've ever had. It's continuously at work, even when we're asleep, processing and organizing information. But what if we told you that it's not just a data bank? What if we revealed that this incredible part of your mind is not a passive receiver, but an active influencer? Yes, the science backs this up. The subconscious mind can actually shape our reality, influencing the decisions we make, the thoughts we have, and even the success we achieve. Neuroscientists and psychologists have provided compelling evidence of this. They've shown how the subconscious mind can affect our physical health, our mental well-being, and even our relationships. It's the reason why a person with a positive mindset tends to attract good things, while a person with a negative mindset often finds themselves in unfavorable situations. Now imagine if you could harness this power. Imagine if you could tap into this vast reservoir and use it to manifest your dreams. It's not just wishful thinking. By understanding and leveraging the power of the subconscious mind, you could potentially change your life. You could overcome obstacles, achieve your goals, and realize your dreams. But here's the thing. This power doesn't come easy. It's not a switch that can be flipped on demand. It requires understanding, training, and discipline. It's like learning a new language or mastering a musical instrument. It requires practice and patience. Indeed, the subconscious mind is a potent force, but the challenge lies in taming and directing it. So how can we harness this power? The answer lies in reprogramming your subconscious mind. Imagine your mind as a computer, with the subconscious acting as the hard drive. Over the years, our experiences, influences, and environmental factors have been installing software shaping our beliefs, habits, and responses. This software is not always beneficial, and often, negative patterns are ingrained into our subconscious, leading to self-limiting beliefs, fears, and behaviors. Now picture reprogramming as updating this software, replacing the outdated and unhelpful programs with new, beneficial ones. This is not about erasing your past experiences, but rather about reshaping your perception and response to them. It's about taking control of your subconscious mind to manifest the life you desire. Think of a garden overgrown with weeds. The weeds represent our negative patterns, and the flowers symbolize our potential for growth and positivity. To cultivate a thriving garden, we must first clear the weeds, then plant and nurture the seeds of our choice. Similarly, reprogramming involves removing negative patterns and planting beneficial ones. However, it's important to remember that reprogramming is not an instant process. Just as a garden doesn't transform overnight, neither does our subconscious mind. It's a journey that requires understanding, dedication, and patience. Understanding to recognize the patterns that need changing, dedication to consistently practice new habits, and patience to allow these new habits to take root and flourish. Just as the gardener doesn't give up when the seeds don't sprout immediately, we shouldn't be disheartened if we don't see instant changes. It's a process, a journey of self-discovery and transformation. Reprogramming isn't about becoming someone else. It's about becoming the best version of ourselves. It's about unlocking our potential and creating a life that resonates with our true self. It's about taking control of our destiny and manifesting our dreams. Reprogramming isn't a magic trick, but a process. A process that requires understanding, dedication, and patience. Now, let's delve into the process of reprogramming the subconscious mind. The path to reprogramming is a journey, not a destination, and it's broken down into simple, actionable steps. These steps are not prescriptive, but rather, they're tools that you can mix and match to suit your needs. They include methods like positive affirmations, visualization, hypnosis, and meditation. Let's start with positive affirmations. These are short, powerful statements that you say to yourself with conviction. They work by replacing negative thoughts with positive ones. It's like planting a seed in a garden. You water it, nurture it, and gradually it grows into a strong, healthy plant. Similarly, positive affirmations, when repeated consistently, take root in your subconscious mind, influencing your thoughts, actions, and overall outlook on life. Next, we have visualization. This is a technique where you imagine yourself in a desired situation or achieving a particular goal. It's like creating a movie in your mind, except you're both the director and the lead actor. 
The trick is to make it as vivid as possible, engaging all your senses. This process sends signals to your subconscious mind that these visualized scenarios are real, nudging it to align your actions with your thoughts and make your dreams a reality. Then there's hypnosis. It's a bit like taking a deep dive into your subconscious mind. In a state of deep relaxation, you become highly responsive to suggestions, making it an ideal time to introduce new ideas and beliefs. With the help of a professional or guided recordings, you can harness the power of hypnosis to reprogram your subconscious mind. Lastly, we have meditation. This is a practice of quieting the mind to achieve a state of consciousness that allows for self-exploration and self-understanding. By regularly practicing meditation, you can gain better control over your thoughts and emotions, which is key in reprogramming your subconscious mind. It's like becoming the master of your own ship, steering it in the direction you want to go. Each of these methods plays a unique role in reprogramming. Positive affirmations and visualization work on the premise of what you think you become. Hypnosis allows you to delve deeper into your subconscious, making it more receptive to change. And meditation provides you with the control needed to direct this change. Remember, the process of reprogramming requires consistency. It's not a one-time event, but a lifestyle change. It's about slowly but surely shifting your thoughts, beliefs, and behaviors to align with your desired outcomes. It's about becoming the best version of yourself, one step at a time. Let's recap the key points we've discussed today. Our journey began with a deep dive into the subconscious mind, that vast and powerful part of ourselves that is always at work, even when we're not aware of it. We learned that our subconscious mind is like a vast reservoir of our thoughts, beliefs, and experiences. It's the part of us that holds our automatic responses, our habits, and our deepest desires and fears. We then shifted our focus to the concept of reprogramming. We discovered that just as a computer programmer can rewrite code to change a software's output, we too can reprogram our subconscious minds to alter our life experiences. The aim is to replace limiting beliefs and negative thought patterns with empowering beliefs and positive thought patterns. We explored several methods to accomplish this task. We discussed the power of affirmations, positive statements that you repeat to yourself regularly. These affirmations work to slowly change your subconscious programming, shifting your beliefs and thought patterns over time. We also delved into the world of visualization, a powerful tool for reprogramming. By creating a vivid mental picture of what you want to achieve, you can start to align your subconscious mind with your conscious goals. Then there was the method of subliminal messages, where positive affirmations are presented in such a way that they bypass the conscious mind and go straight to the subconscious. Also highlighted was the power of hypnosis, a method that uses relaxation and focused attention to reach the subconscious mind, allowing for the introduction of new ideas and beliefs. And let's not forget about meditation, a practice that can help you quiet your mind, making it easier for you to access and influence your subconscious. We emphasize the importance of consistency in this process. Reprogramming doesn't happen overnight. It requires persistence and dedication. You need to regularly practice these methods to see real lasting changes. With these tools in your arsenal, you are now ready to harness the power of your subconscious mind. This journey into the depths of your subconscious mind is just the beginning. Imagine the transformation that will unfold when you consistently apply these techniques, when you make them an integral part of your life. The power to manifest your dreams lies within you, waiting to be unlocked. We've discussed multiple ways to reprogram your subconscious, each with its unique approach. Now it's your turn to dive in, explore, and discover which methods resonate with you the most. Remember, progress may not always be a straight line, but each step, each stumble, each victory, is a part of your journey towards self-realization. We'd love to hear about your experiences, your progress, and the dreams you're manifesting. So go ahead, share your stories in the comments section. Let's make this a space for growth and learning. Don't forget to like this video if you found it informative, comment with your thoughts, and subscribe for more insightful content. Until next time, keep exploring the power within you.